Well, I have a doctor of physiology, form and function, Dr. Graham Cox here joining us with a brand new launch for us here at QVC. Absolutely. Clear. Congratulations. This is amazing. It's such a clever, such a simple idea in some respects, which are often the best. Brand new on QVC, yet you've already got two five-star reviews, you know? Yes, we've got great reviews from Autocar, Auto Express, and many, many other magazines and back specialists especially. So with your background, you've created something that we put into our car, yes. onto our seat belts. What actually is it? Okay, it's called Shoft. We invented it from Sean Connery saying soft, so Shoft, and it's a marvelous thing. <laughs> and like Shoft, Shoft is a small uh, device mm -hmm. uh, made of a lovely tactile elastomer, yep. and it fits just simply onto your seat belt tongue. You know the bit that you grab when you buckle up? Yeah, to click in. That's the bit that's hanging up on the, on the buckle. Mm -hmm. And shoft basically fits in two seconds. Just stick it on, and that's it fitted. And once you've fitted, you can take it off if you choose, if you change your car. But equally, you're not having to faff every time yeah. you get into the car. A lot of people, if they're using other cars, they take it off and they'll take it with them in their case. Um, if they're going on a long trip, just stick it on the, the seatbelt tongue. And it uh, helps you sit in the safest and healthiest position every mile of the trip. So this is obviously the key reason that you've come up with this, not just as an inventor <coughs> to, to create something that's going to make you a fortune, but for a very serious reason. Let's have a little look at what we're seeing there on the screen. We've got a, a definite yes and a definite no position going yes, if on. Yes, if you look at the, um, the left-hand side or with the X next to it, that's how 95% of us tend to spend our times in our cars. Mm -hmm. It's not our fault. We want to sit properly. And in fact, if you look on the right-hand side there, that's how we tend to start off our journey. We sit yep. up in the seat, Everything's looking good. Yep. Only within a few minutes or a few miles, we end up in position on the left, which is uh, not only uh, not very good for you, um, but it also can help the, the seat belt can cut across your neck. Uh, and it's just not a very good posture. It doesn't matter how expensive the seats are. It doesn't matter how good your lumbar support is. Um, it doesn't help, really, if the car is literally shaking you down in the okay. seat. So we're looking at this for two reasons. We're looking at this as a more improved safety feature, I would suggest. And we're also looking at this for our own physique and our own look, care of our own posture and our own back. There's some great reviews, actually, that you were talking about that people have trial tested it. Autocar, I think we all know Autocar. Look, they've given it five stars. If you're looking for a little more support from your seatbelt, shoft might be just the answer. Mm. And obtrusively slipping over the buckle present, prevents the lap belt from slackening. It's a great buy. Our sitting Sick position click. was much more comfortable. Let me just quickly give you the details because you do get a set of two. You're choosing to go for either all black or the orange option. 40967 is the item number. £20 the price for the duo. How many seat belts have you got in your car? You've got your passenger, your driver, and then you've generally got them in the back. Is that where your children are going? I think a double order might be necessary. Multi-buy, save on your post and packaging. OK, we've got a, a little okay, mock-up so car going on. let's see how it works, because it seems a sim simple little yeah. uh, device. Um, so we tend to sit in our cars and, as I said, sit in the upright, mm -hmm. um, and we all have good intentions sitting upright mm -hmm. for the whole journey. Mm -hmm. The trouble is, after a few seconds, we tend to slouch. You do such a move. You, when you yeah. drive, you move, you're looking yeah. around, you're checking traffic and things as well, aren't you? So if I can just buckle up here, as I normally would do. So ROSPA, the Royal Society of Protection of Accidents, they say you should basically sit right back in the seat. Yeah. Really important. Okay. Okay. Make sure the seat belt's not twisted and low on the, on the lap. It's called a lap belt, not a tummy belt. Good yeah? point. And then give it a tug and take all the slack out. All of the crash tests are done with no slack in the seat belt. And so the best way of using the seat belt is to actually have no slack. That so that sense. needs to stay slackless. Okay, okay. okay. So that sto how does it stop it from moving? Okay, so this is without a shoft now. Mm -hmm. And uh, if I was in a car now, especially with leather seats, what tends to happen is the usual. A little bit of a slump. And I don't know, if you look across at traffic lights, you may look across uh, at other, other drivers, everyone's doing this. We're trying to get comfortable. And they sit back up. We're in our cars so much, aren't we? I mean, goodness me, the journey's into work sometimes for me, the M25 car park everyone talks about. It's, it's hideous. And if you do have problems with your, with your back as well, I can only think that sitting in the right alignment's yeah. got to be good for us. Yeah. So if we look at this, that's the normal slack that you get in a seatbelt, mm -hmm. and that can ride up over your tummy. Onto your tummy. OK? Mm -hmm. Now, riding along like that, uh, it's not going to help your back. It's not going to help if you're pregnant, actually, if it's riding up. You don't yes, want it over yes. a bump, do there you? There are some women that don't wear seat belts just because of the horror of thinking about the lap belt okay. moving up over the bump. So this will be really good, sick. actually, if you're pregnant, because it will keep it, it keeps into the it lap low belt position. On the lap, not on your tummy. Okay. Exactly. It keeps it nice and low, and it's really comfortable. I'll let you have a go in a minute. Okay. But anyway, that's without. Now let's put shoft on. So if you can just see, this is how it fits, okay? 
Have I, got, so I know it's dead easy because we're seeing it, but do you show us how? Oh yes, look, there's a little yes, we get a leaflet in every single le pack to show exactly just how it's fitted. Show you as well that that will come with and that's shot. it fitted. Did you blink? You might have missed it. Okay. Okay. So that's it. So you buckle up as you would normally do. Yep. Remember, sit back in the seat, click it in place, make sure it's not twisted, make sure it's low on, nice the, on the pelvis, right down low, take the and slack. then take out the slack, give it a nice tug, and look at that. That is absolutely solid. I want to have a go. Do you want to just yes. try and pull that? I'm not sure I should. It's not <laughs> actually, Dr. Graham. <laughs> you can pull that. That is not going anywhere. I'll take your word for it and okay. I can see it. Do you want yes. to go? I'll have a go. Okay, let's try without I won't first. invite you to test either. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, just okay. move my pack so, so I this can is, get my so right So this is position. without first, Claire, okay? So buckle up as you normally would do. Sit back in the seat. And that's a normal seat belt as you would have in all of the cars around the UK. Yeah. All right. Yeah. After a little while, though, you can see that that. Right. Yeah. I'm, look, I'm already. This bit here. Having a slump. Yeah. Okay. And Pop that moves it on up. for me. Okay. Yep. Okay. So all you do is just put. You see that? That just goes on. Neatly sits in. Okay. Not the difficult. nice thing is, no tools I put it on, required. This is the same in a Porsche or a Ferrari as it is in a Clio. So it makes it feel beautiful. And if you can just buckle up now. All right. We've Hang on. You're right. Yeah. yeah. There Take we go. Take it back the right Buckle way first. Up. There we go. And done. Oh my gosh. Seriously, seriously, that is really, really different. I think a multi-order is necessary, isn't it? Graham, thank you. Great to see you. Thanks, Claire. It's the Ionic Hairbrush next.